What's going on people? I'm playing English aka P, another episode of Real Footy Banter. The breaking news for LFC is we are on the verge of finally signing Mohamed Salah from Roma. It's been going back and forth for a little while now and negotiations are finally kind of settled down. The fee seems to be set at around 35 to 39 million. So, I don't know, it depends because there's add-ons right now involved in Salah. What does he bring to the table? Very fast, natural lefty. Very comfortable in finishing, very comfortable in assisting. I think he had like 15 goals and 11 assists last year in Serie A. Obviously, some might say it's not the same level as competition in terms of the Premiership. At the same time though, when you get those stats against defensive teams in Italy, you're doing something right. I'm not gonna lie, we were linked with him in 2014, we're supposed to get him. Uh, last minute, Jose Mourinho came in and done his work, whatever, on the phone and convinced Mo to go to Chelsea. So I was happy back then, hoping we would get him from Basel. Didn't go through, he went Chelsea, obviously. Opportunities were limited as well, you know what I mean? Now he's coming to us, it seems. I'm not going to be fully, fully, fully confident until I see pictures taken with him in the shirt or holding the shirt up at Anfield. But it seems like it's going to get done. Apparently he flew into London today where we've got one of our offices and... He's doing his medical on Thursday. So hopefully it goes through. No situation like the Van Dyke situation. What he brings to the table is a lot of pace. So between him and Mane on either side, that is arguably, I would say, the, the quickest win combination in the Prem, if not the world. And we know Klopp likes the high press. So he will bring that. Like I said before, he's done it in Italy. He's got to see if he can do it in the Prem now. It's a faster game, but at the same time, he's... I'm telling you right now, if many don't know him, he's easily one of the quickest players in the Prem if he comes. You know what I mean? Pause. Salah's 25 years old, which is obviously the kind of age that Klopp's looking for. It's supposed to be a five-year deal worth about, I think he's getting about 90,000 a week apparently, which apparently is nearly double what he was getting at Roma. So obviously he's going to be happy with that. But like I said, it's definitely a good signing, especially a good signing because we're obviously going to be trying to get into the group stages of Champions League which means more games, hopefully. So that means we need a bigger squad, more quality to the squad. Last year, we lacked in depth and that kind of showed up. I think we could have got third place if we really had that depth and less injuries and stuff like that. But this season, like I said, hopefully this is the first of many for my club. Let's make it happen. We need more. Is it, is it even worth it right now if we don't get a centre back? That's a question because going forward, it weren't too bad last year, but at the back, it's still a bit nervy, you know what I mean? But what Mo Salah does add he does add that, that ability to break down more defences because I think we got found out a little bit. Like with teams that weren't, weren't maybe as gifted as us going forward, they sat back. You know what I mean? Your West Broms and maybe your Stokes and stuff. They kind of sat back and we had to kind of break them down. You know what I mean? So I think that it's one of them ones where now with people like Mo Salah, it kind of gives you more opportunity to break defences down. You know what I mean? So hopefully that, that adds to the equation in terms of that, but we need to still sign a centre back for me. I still want Van Dijk to, hopefully it's not dead, but we need Van Dijk or someone like that who can who can team up with Matip and have flipping Lovren on the bench for me, you know what I mean? Play here and there with certain games, you know what I mean? And go from there. But yeah, like I said, Mo Salah, for me, very good sign and I'm happy with it. We still need more. It should be the first of many, um, to, not many, but I mean, I need about three or four more, I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, so we'll see. But as of now, like I said, Mo Salah, LFC, should be going through this week. Let's see how it goes. Make sure you like, share, comment, tell a friend to tell a friend. I'm out. Subscribe.